You use path constraint to constrain an object's movement to follow a predefined path or paths. The direction of motion is defined by the way the path is drawn. The first vertex on a spline represents the starting point. In sub-object mode, the first vertex is shown in yellow. You can reverse a path by forcing its other end as a first vertex. To constrain an object to a path, you first select the object. You then choose the Path Constraint tool and point to the path to which you want to constrain the object's motion. This relocates the object and instructs it to follow the path based on the length of the animation as defined in the project. By default, the constrained object moves along the spline but doesn't follow it. Notice the car around the bend. To make the car follow the path, you need to enable the follow option. Based on how the model was created, it might not be pointing the correct way. Try a different axis orientation. If the vehicle seems to be moving backward, use the flip option. The bank option introduces a rotation as the constrained object makes a turn. This is more useful for airplanes than cars. The bank amount can be adjusted and animated. You can also leave this option unchecked and manually animate the rotation track on the constrained object. Many professionals prefer to animate their vehicles by linking them to helpers that are constrained to paths. This way, the user has complete freedom to introduce secondary animation to the vehicle while it follows the constrained helper. When constraining an object, you have the possibility of using multiple paths to define the motion. All you need to do is choose the Add Path option and select other paths in the scene. By default, the object is equally constrained between the various paths. The objective is to animate the weight between the various paths to create a push-pull effect for the constrained vehicle. This method can be used to alter a vehicle motion to avoid an obstacle, for example. Another use would be to have multiple vehicles constrained to the same path and yet have slightly different trajectories between them. 